Good morning, everybody. You got Papa Spin here. We're going to talk about the single seed challenge that uh, Black Gumbo is putting together. I uh, just wanted to put our little seed in and see how it works out. So you got me and Holly here somewhere, wherever she ran off to. But uh, what I'm going to work toward is cucumelons, something I've never even heard of to here recently. And uh, so we're going to go back first off and I think I'm gonna make my own seed mixture. So I'm gonna do about two part peat, two parts of my compost, and one part of the pedia, perlite, to mix it up and make it real airy. So as we're walking to the back part of the garden, we'll mix those up in the wheelbarrow. Let's see if we can't find holly somewhere. First thing I want to do is mix up a just a little bit of my compost. So I'm gonna do two parts of the compost. One part. This is some sifted compost that I'm working on this pile here next. So there's two parts of compost. One part peat. Two part peat and some perlite. Right. One part perlite. This is just a seed mixture. You can go to a heavier compost once the seedlings get up. Cucumelons, also known as Japanese sour gherkins, look a lot like a watermelon. They're grow like a cucumber and they're small which looks to me be about like a kumquat or something up on the vine here comes holly i guess she decided to join us all right holly let's get this seed mixture going so we can be a part of black gumbo's Single seed challenge. You ready? Huh? What you think? All right, let's mix all this up. And I got a container back in the shop that we'll start our single seed with.
Titus. So let's let's open up our seeds. Sowing the seed. Cucumins are best started indoors six to eight weeks prior to the last frost. Small seeds resembling cucumber seeds can be sown at a depth of a quarter inch under topsoil. Sowing indoors, you might consider using peat moss for easy transplanting later on. Transplant or direct sow your cucumelon outdoors after all danger of frost has passed and the soil is loose and workable. Water, sunlight, and soil preferences. Cucumelons will prefer an area of full sunlight and prefer a soil that is rich. The plants can be watered regularly until established. Once your plants start to bear fruit, they will not need as much water and are actually somewhat drought resistant as well. Consider adding a bit of light compost to hard compacted soil to improve your drainage. Provide a trellis or support. Stake for the plants. Germination and growth. Cucumelon seeds are not quick to germinate and can sometimes take up to four weeks to show signs of life. That's going to take a little bit of uh, patience there. The plants can grow to a vining length of up to 72 inches long and can be spaced about 6 to 12 inches apart from one another. If they are grown upright with the support of a trellis, Harvest the small 1 to 2 inch fruits in roughly 60 to 70 days. Add to your salads, eat raw, or pickle these cuties. Uh, they're also called Mexican sour chirkins. Alright, so let's see what these critters look like here. Wow, they are small. They look just about like a sesame seed. That's about as small. So they just look a little bit, you know, resemble a sesame seed some. All right, let's, uh, let's, get our, uh, let's get our pot to going. First thing I like to do is just cover the drainage hole up with a little rock. Got that going on. All right, then we got our seed mixture. That we just put together. I'll tell you what. Just using one seed, that little old seed, that's going to be a trick. I think I'll put a, a little bit of water. Quarter inch. Let's see if we can't follow approximately what they would want right there. So I'll just put it right here in the middle. And I would say that's a quarter inch. All right, folks. I don't know how to. Pick the best seed, but let's go with this guy right here. One seed. I don't know what the germination rate of these things are. Here he is. All right. Live long and prosper there, buddy. Single seed has been planted. Today's date is November 20th of 20. So we'll keep an eye on this cucumelon. See what happens. All right. 
Well, that's all for Papa Spin and the uh, single seed challenge. We'll keep you updated. What do you think, Holly? You gonna keep them updated? All right, y'all have a good growing season.